The Secretary of the Interior is in Colorado. Ryan Zink is speaking at the Institute Freedom Conference in Steamboat Springs. His visit is drawing protests from people who say Zinke's department is ignoring their concerns about the environment. CBS 4's Matt Crosha live there tonight. Matt, looks like a protest is stirring up. Yeah, this thing's supposed to get kicked off at about 5.30. There could be upwards of 500 to 1,000 people, all of them underneath the Stand for Our Land banner, but with definitely different ideas about what all of that means. I spoke to the secretary tonight, and he tells us that, hey, he is listening, but people here might not like what he has to say. There is a passion about all things great outdoors. And Only on the job since last year and already growing a reputation. As my job is to make sure our public lands are maintained, managed uh, for the future, and public lands belong to everybody. A top priority dealing with these wildfires and their root causes in a new way. And the dead and dying timber and the fuel loads are too heavy. So when you do have these fires, they become catastrophic in size. In some places, the temperature is so hot, it's actually burning the soil. And for those that, that don't want to actively manage the forest, that want to protect habitat, I would say it's better to actively manage than watching the habitat burn down. Already this year, hundreds of homes lost across Colorado and the West. People have also lost their lives. Secretary Zinke wants more offense instead of playing defense. Spending two and a half billion dollars plus fighting forest fires. And we import lumber in this country. And there's billions of board feet that are lying on the fourth floor rotting. Lofty goals. He says he won't stop until they're accomplished. This protest is uh, supposed to go all evening until uh, they hope that Secretary Zinke will actually come down here, but of course that hasn't been confirmed yet. As for the Freedom Conference, it will be up at the resort all weekend. We're live tonight in Steamboat Springs, Matt Kroschel covering Colorado First. Thank you, Matt. Right now, an update for you on the effort to make